just a, and hello all this is La La Madness and um <clears throat> I actually am doing a moment of madness because I just happened to have went and got this delicious Marcos pizza here. Oh well I guess we'll do it that way. Hello Primo. And there's my little raggedy ads receipt. So we're just gonna get that out the way because it's in the way. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Now you know I be loving to eat. Mm -hmm, I'm not ashamed. This wig is doing the most right now. Okay, I know you knew and you just gotta be seen. So anywho, back to this Marco's piece. So We've done the ribs. We've done some other foods. And now I have a thing for Marco's Pizza. So now we're going to go ahead and get this delicious. Now, we do know that I have a thing here, you know, for um, already taking a sample. But in this case, I didn't have any yet. I've shared. So I'm going to go ahead and get my pre-sliced, oh, oh, I'm gonna steal some meat from someone else, thank you. Mm -hmm. You know, it's always that one slice, oh, I'm gonna take that too, mm -hmm. put that on there. The more balls, the better. All right, now, honey, it's pizza though. Now, this is the only place that I know that uses these big ass sausages. Mm, see that big ass sausage? It's like almost the size. Like yeah, it's a it's a big sausage. It's like the size of my eye. Mm. Mm hmm. Mm. So this is high quality, good, good, good pizza. In my opinion, I like it better than Papa John's. Mmm. Mmm. Mm hmm. Mmm. Mmm. Chow. You gotta have your little cup of juice, cause you know you eat that bread, you gotta let it swell up. Mm. Oh, uh, you see they have the real, like the crispy pepperoni, not the like extra greasy, nasty kind, but the crispy kind with the big ass sausages, not them little bitty sausages like they made some ground beef and you know, the little bitty chopped up, you know, mm -hmm. and then they put this little like garlic flavoring on the crust. Mm. I don't know I was supposed to be having one bite to show y'all, but mm. we're going to eat this together. Mm-hmm. Mm. Marco's, honey, I want to let you know you're doing a great job because this pizza is the shit. Just a regular old pepperoni and sausage. And you know what I want to tell you guys? About marketing. So I was really thinking today, hmm, what do I want? I want something which, you know, I'm not, you know, um, I do eat at home. Because mm -hmm, mama cooks, believe that. Mama can throw down, baby. Got some leftover meatloaf in there now that I cook. But... You always deserve that good old night out when you decide to go do something else. And so I opened my email and I was like, Marcos, you thought about me and you thought about me as a customer and as a way to lure my ass back in as well and get another sale, which works for you. So, oh, well, and me too, because I'm going to eat this good ass pizza. However, for those that does not think that marketing really works, all from an email me and Marcos gets to share this slice here. Mm. From them to me. 
Mm. Mm. All I know is it says something about three dollars off. Mm-hmm. Mm. It's not too greasy. It's the bomb. I get that good old garlic crust. Mm. Now I have put some lip gloss on before this, but clearly as you can see, even though I said it's not greasy, Marco has helped, you know, re-grease me as well. See that? Rub it together. Keep it going. A little sausage juice and pepperoni juice and lip gloss all together in one. However, back to this marketing. So, apparently, marketing works because, yeah, I was thinking about getting something, but that email just hit me from down under, from within, and said, you might as well spend this ten dollars because Marco's gonna give you three dollars off. So why not? And that right there is when a nigga plan on spending his money anyway. You might as well drop him an email to be a reminder that you're still in existence. Mm -hmm. So when you go, oh, you know, does marketing work? Does emailing? Previous customers work. Does giving them a quick text work? That shit works. Oh, excuse me. Mm. Apparently, must have been hitting the spot because that was a little bark there. Excuse me, everybody. Mm. Mm. With that good ass Tropicana juice, because they had them on sale for eighty-eight cents. That has nothing to do with Marcos. But they go very well together. Mm. But I do want to let you know that Marcos, I like you better than Papa John's. My kids, as well as other Papa Johners, would be so devastated to hear me say that right now. But, Papa, you all right. But you ain't all right. You know what I'm saying? So, Now, y'all know, this is why, excuse my little messenger ringing in the background because I have my computer open because I was uploading videos earlier today. And I know when I get ready to film, I have to delete my messenger. And that was Kyle, K-H-Y-A-L, that was calling. Okay. All right. Well, Kyle, I'm filming. Sorry. I'll get back to you shortly as soon as this is done. However, me and my new wig that I have named Ruby. See, it? we're enjoying some Marcos with this good ass cute. Wait a minute. What is this little piece? Right? Oh, there we go. Mm -hmm. Got to get her together. You know, you got to do that fluffing time. All right. So me and um, Ruby here are going to enjoy this delicious Marcos pizza. Because Marcos, once again, is the shit. And then Marcos, if you want to give me, you know, a free pizza or two, you know how you play it, pretend like I won that little contest where you give them free pizza for a year, sign me up. But anywho, try you some Marcos. I sure did. Now I'm going to find something else to go try because I'm always hungry. Ta-ta. Okay.